What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the Dewan Moore Show. It has been a fucking while since I made a video. I do apologize, and I do want to say thank you to all the new subscribers who have subscribed to the channel. And by the way, if you haven't subscribed to the Dewan Moore Show, go ahead and do so right now and ring that bell so you know when I upload my next video. With that being said, I'd like to say thank you to Germany, Malaysia, and the United Kingdom for being the top viewers outside of the U.S., even though nationalism is fucking stupid. And also, U.S. citizens, Puerto Rico is a part of the fucking United States, you idiots. So they're U.S. citizens, even though we don't treat them like that, even though we should. So go look that shit up, you fucking morons. Also, Flint, Michigan still has fucked up water, and... They're using your tax money to drop 120 fucking bombs a day. Hashtag 120. Hashtag 120 bombs in your name every day. They're bombing so much outside this country that we're not officially war at that we're running out of fucking bombs, or they, sorry, are running out of fucking bombs to drop on brown people around the world. So, uh, so the point, the reason why I'm making this video today, aside from trying to get out some of that other information that I just dropped on your head, is there's this video rolling around on the internet right now, and it's a man that accosts a Puerto Rican woman who is at a park to be there for a birthday party of some sort. And this man accosts her, and he's, like, in her zone, he's really physical, and... You're going to be able to actually have to go look that video up yourself. I am going to hit you with the audio, so you'll be able to hear the audio. I have not watched the video in its entirety. I'm going to try and do that right now. Also, as this is all going down, there is a police officer on the scene who just watches it go down. And I'm going to talk about that in just a little bit. So here we go. Okay, why are you wearing that? This... Why are you wearing that? That's such a fascist thing to say. You, it's, I thought this was America, where you were free to wherever you want. As, as long as it's not like decapitated kittens, you're free to wear just about whatever you want. So, I actually... Uh, Went back in the video a little bit. Apologies. What's your point, sir? Because I can. Why are you wearing that? I'm renting this area. Not only. I didn't know that she. I thought she was just personally there, just like just attending. But she's being paid. She's paying to be harassed. That's a. That's. Always a treat. This dude literally got up, walked up, and is like as close as you and I are right now. Now I guarantee you, and like I said, there's a cop about over there. I guarantee you, if I hopped up to any woman of any nationality and was like, hey, wow, waving my arms. What are you doing wearing that shirt? I'd be surprised if we were having this conversation right now. We'd be having a different conversation. Officer, officer, I feel highly uncomfortable. 
Now, there's an officer there, and she approaches him, which is ridiculous because the fact that she is telling this man to get away from her vocally and loud multiple times should be more than enough for for anyone to become involved, much less a peace officer. As you can see, the police are not even, he's not even grabbing him. Like, he's, this guy's just walking up to me. He basically got in my face. Damn near almost touched me. This is what happened, guys. This is what happened. That's it. That's it. So now... Jesus Christ, this guy so this guy's a real piece of work. Okay, so it looks like a big guy is showing up, so this is definitely somewhat deterred the guy. So now he's over with the cop again. He's still, and he's still going on, like ham. Go back to Mexico, Puerto Rican, in front of the cop. He just doesn't even care. All right. I've seen enough. Like I was saying, if I approached any female of any creed, the way and manner that this man did, I, I, I would, at best, be in jail, and at worst, not be speaking to you ever, you know, just dead. But just fucking dead. They would have fucking killed me. So, uh, follow up, the cop that, uh, there was another police officer that did initially, that arrived on the scene and apprehended the man he was arrested for harassment. And the cop that did nothing can do nothing at a desk now because he was demoted to desk duty. So, with that being said, again, Flint, Michigan still has fucked up water. Um, they're still dropping 120 bombs in your name a day. If you live in the USA, write to congressman or woman about that. Um, I know this was really, I feel like this was a shit episode. So, sorry. Uh, quality will be a lot better next time. Peace. Oh, in person winner contest, I haven't forgot about you. I'm actually going to go see about that right now. Later.